how's it going? Dr. Sterling here. Today I'm going to explain to you guys something that I use in the office a lot and that is kinesiology taping, which looks kind of like this. If you zoom in, you can see there are a little bit of striations. It's kind of like a fingerprint. And what's interesting about that is that it adheses to the skin to provide a lot of mechanical correction. It helps to, it helps for the blood flow, the lymphatic flow, it helps to uh, recover injured muscles and it helps to support joints. So it does a lot of different things. I use it for uh, a lot of different types of patients, a lot of different types of injuries or rehab processes. So today as an example, I'm going to show you on a patient. This is Kenny uh, and I'm going to explain to you why I do a specific tape job and how it can help him out. So the first thing that I'm going to do, he works out and he often gets some type of pain in the front of the shoulder. And this is also common for people that exercise a lot, is they get a pain in the front of the shoulder, which is from uh, the anterior part of the shoulder. It has some type of instability. So when there's an instability, it's because you have the pec muscle here that attaches in here, and you also have the front part of the deltoid. So these are a lot of the power muscles when you do the bench pressing, and you do the overhead pressing, you use all these muscles in here, and oftentimes the front part of the shoulder can get uh, can get quite painful and it can and it can cause some problems. So I'm gonna help him out with that today. Um, the first tape that I'm gonna do is here on the deltoid, and that is to just support his shoulder. So come over here and check this out. I'm going to, you can see he's kind of got the shape of the deltoid in here just like this, right? So I'm gonna do a tape job to actually support this specific muscle right in here. I'm gonna start it down like this. Good. And with a little bit of tension, we're going to go around the deltoid here, all the way to the top, just like that. And same thing here, we're gonna go around the front side now. Just a little bit of tension, and again, just like that. Looks pretty good there. So what I'm gonna do here as part two of the tape job is I'm going to tape uh, the top part here. So you have the humerus, you have the clavicle, and you have the scapula. They all come together to form a joint that has a lot of range of motion. But because you have a lot of range of motion, you then have instability. And if you do a lot of weight, you expose yourself to injury. So I'm gonna help him out and I'm gonna, I'm gonna stabilize this area right here. And I'm gonna do it like this, just like this. Another tape right on top here. We've got the AC joint, a little bit of stretch, some downward pressure. Gonna hold it down, move the arm a little forward so we have a little bit of movement there. Good. And then you're gonna bring the arm back and we're gonna apply the rest just like that. So depending on the type of the injury, you can move the arm in a specific way. You can externally rotate, you can internally rotate, you can bring the arm forward or backward. And what that can do is to help the tape, um, help it in a specific range of motion or area that causes it to be painful. So depending on the type of injury, the taping might be a little bit different. So for this last tape job, I'm going to tape from the front here all the way around, uh, around the deltoid to the back of the shoulder. And what that will do is help to support this whole joint in like that. And therefore this whole thing will be a lot more supported than it was when he first came in. So it's gonna go just like this here, up and in, and again. So move your arm back for me, great. And we're gonna lock in the tape there. Move the arm a little forward. Very good. And we're gonna lock in the tape right there in the back. Good, you can relax there. So now, as you can see, we've kind of got this whole joint locked in, supported, and when he, you know, he can go and exercise, he's not that, that injured. You can, uh, a lot of athletes have these because they're able to play sports with them on, a lot of, uh, a lot of, uh, Olympians have them also so they can run uh, as, the, as their hamstring repairs. The whole point is that it's not a cast. It's, it's just a component of the body to help it to help it recover easier and help you as you still do all the things that you need to do and that you want to do. It just helps you to not put extra stress on the joint and or the muscle. How does the shoulder feel now if you move it around a little bit? How does that feel with all the tape on it? 
feels good. It feels really like supported. Yeah, and as you can see, he's still able to move and do a lot of the range of motion. Uh, it's just able to lock him in so that as he lifts, as he does everything, yep, just like that, it doesn't impinge or, or inhibit him. It actually helps him from doing that with just the right amount of stability. I hope that was a little bit informative and uh, he's all taped up. And if you guys have any questions, comment below or let me know. And uh, there are a lot of applications for any type of the kinesiology taping. Um, so I'm here to help.